Y'all, yeah, hey, my boy Derek yeah, Griffin, hey. Rugby Chicago, is here with me. Yes, Join me for the show. Manifest cubs, greatness. Jersey, I don't think I told Number you about that, bro. I, I, love, cubs, I love the Cubs, man. man. I love the Cubs, man. Mm-hmm. If y'all ain't repping Cubs, don't even talk to me, bro. It's that serious. Like, mm-hmm. it's that serious, bro. <laughs> don't Just do me like that. Too. Hey, my boy yeah, brought the man. saxophone today. What sax you got? Uh, we got today? the tenor, man. Tenor sax. That's my primary, man. That's what mm-hmm. I do, man. Yeah. Humble. Kendrick Lamar. Kendrick Derek Griffin. Check it out. Honestly, like to be real, I didn't think that the saxophone with a hip hop beat would sound so good to be real. Oh, like, yeah, I, I think yeah. I heard about the idea, but I didn't think it was like it's gonna uh, be. Shit, once you hear it, bro, like, that's all it is. You gotta hear it, man. That's so, all it is, man. I could do. Ready. He said I could do whatever. I'm ready. I'm ready for it. West Side, West Side Chicago. Ooh. I got to show it. West Side Chicago, stand up. Oh shit. He said he could do whatever we're gonna see. Ooh. We're gonna see. Oh shit, he's gonna take me into another area code. <laughs> yeah. We'll see. I don't know if he can do this one. We'll alright, alright, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna figure it out. Chicago West Side, stand up. Was that from the beat or was that you just in your head had a melody and you just kept that? Bruh, that shit's in my head, man. It's just like I'm feeling it, then I go back, you know what I mean? Kind of like that beat. I 
be like gangsta rap in the yeah, shower. Right, right. <laughs> like, I was just gonna go. Yeah, yeah, man. Da, 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 yeah. Da, da, da. But you know what? I think that's what's so cool, bro. Like that's why that's why I wanna like tap into this because a lot of people don't see jazz like a, a jazz instrument, something that fits oh. with hip hop. Oh. And I can I, I can show why we can do that. You know what I'm saying? So my boy got the sax out. Got his website right here. I'm gonna put a link in the bottom so I can check it out. Eric Griffin, DGSax.com. Got all the information you need right there. Yeah. Social media, upcoming events, all that. Around the city, you may catch me doing a gig at some local bar, anything of that nature. If anything, just check out my Instagram story. I post a lot on there now because I just love the feature and how it provides people with the recognition, which I will be giving people. Derek underscore Griffin four five. Yep. So that that's right, where you can check right me there. out for sure. Definitely just follow my story and and give me feedback on what I'm doing because that's what's gonna make me better i think that's the other thing too is people take rec uh constructive criticism as a negative thing it's got this negative connotation over it ne negative uh uh constructive criticism is just to get you better like as an individual period if you take it the wrong way that's on you in my opinion that's how i look at it you know if you take it in a way that oh man he's talking about me he doesn't want me to do better that's that's your problem in my eyes like if you want to get better you got to figure you out what it is that you're not doing yeah. right and go back to the drawing board. That's exactly. all it is, man. I I I I live for that. I'm like, bro, that. let me know. That's please. That. And that's the reason, that's the exact reason why I did this vlog. Yeah. Because I've been I've seen too many people you know, in back in my neighborhood who are 40 years old, 50 right. years old, and they yeah. have great ideas, but ideas aren't shit in this world. If you don't have an actual product, then it's like, okay, good, everybody's bro. idea. So you need to do something, but like, they don't know that's how to take Gary v right there, bro. I don't know how to that's take, that Gary how v. Do I take the first <laughs> step. How do I take the first step? Well, I know it doesn't have to be perfect, but if you don't take a step, bro. then what the fuck are you going to do? You're just, you just sitting down thinking. So it's like, do that's something, have something to prove for your time, something. That's it doesn't right. have to be great, but have something to prove that's, for That's that something. Gary V right there. And you know what's interesting, bro? My guy, Peter Hoshauser, who I mentioned earlier, he's probably my biggest mentor besides my parents. I mean, I love my parents, but he's but I, outside of my family, hands down. Like, he literally is creating what's called disrupt education, bro. Mm -hmm. And what that is, is teaching high school students to know that you can you can fail. Like, it's okay to fail. That's like, what college that's the problem. At. That's the problem with a lot of institutions, bro. Like, yeah. they, they, they think that standardized tests are the way to go, and that's the only way of life. You mm -hmm. have to understand that you're not gonna be judged by a test, okay. bro. This is my boy Derek Griffin right here. One and only Dow Robert Morris University. That's right. Doing big things. Vlog number three, Manifest that's Greatness. Right. I appreciate you coming out. Hey, man. Anytime, man. Oh, yeah. You already know, much love. No doubt. Appreciate it.